any age, STEM, vitally important what we do here, making race cars go fast and succeed in the IMSA WeatherTech Sports Car Championship. I said to Aaron, if your mom and dad support this, I would like to commission you to build a wind tunnel for this 18th scale size car that we could use in our STEM program. It was one of the most gratifying moments to see his eyes light up and off we go. It's quite a little bit of a difficult process, especially when you're a beginner in the software, but um, I already had some previous experience from designing other stuff, so I basically knew where all the controls were and how everything worked. So it was a pretty easy phase itself, but um, since the wind tunnel itself and the car is too big for the build volume of the build plate, we had to design everything in separate parts and adding a little slit onto each one so they all connected properly into each other, and that was also a pretty hard phase to design because you have to make sure they design well because most printers have a little bit of a smaller tolerance to it so basically if you um, make something a certain dimension then sometimes it'll be like maybe 0 0.1 0 0.2 millimeter offset the main focus was is also creating first of all creating a flush gap in between both of the parts so that you, there's no seams because if there's seams then that means the air could get in and that could disrupt the main airflow so we, on the previous designs we had to put a little bit of gaffer tape just to seal everything up and make sure they're um, good to go but we also basically just had to make sure everything was flush just make sure the air properly went through i've been so thankful for the investment that a company like Konica Minolta, a company like Gainbridge has made in the STEM program that we've kicked off here in 2025. At least in 2025, six weekends, we're gonna bring top high school students from the market of where we're racing uh, to give them that deeper experience. Definitely go see Michelin, but at a deeper level. Go visit race teams, go have uh, our safety folks talk about um, helmets and, and fire retardant materials and go visit Bosch, so giving them a much deeper experience where they can absolutely make parallels to what they're learning in the classroom. Um, at the end of the day, my blue sky dream would be to host the largest motorsports and auto industry job fair um, in the name of IMSA. You don't, you don't uh, get it done unless you, you dream it up and, and I think that would be for me just this pathway of empowering the next generation for our sport, but also for the industry. He was there, he was smiling really big. He, he gave me a big hug, almost crushed me slightly. And then, but once the ch students came today, actually, it was a pretty nice, uh, I explained everything, turned it on a little, did a little demonstration, answered all the questions, and then gave out some of the flyers that we had. Watch us this season on NBC and Peacock. Be sure to subscribe to IMSA on YouTube and enjoy our brand new IMSA Endurance Hour podcast. And if you're interested in digital activation in motorsports, visit IMSA.com partnership.